Good morning. Good morning. Good morning to you. Good morning, y'all. So this is what's happening this morning. Um, I'm actually walking back from Jalen bus stop. He always got a fucking issue with this goddamn bus stop, and I don't have it. I don't have it. So um there was a little issue not too long ago. They oh look at the little squirrel. Uh-uh, your brother was bad and he getting fucked up <laughs> so listen oh um, there was a little issue i don't know he came home yesterday talking about they took his name down blah 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 he always don't never know shit but always in some shit so i said oh well uh you got a whole fucking phone for you to text me let me know what's going on you didn't do none of that so how the fuck you want me to know like i i be needing a heads up you know what i'm saying heads up so when it's time for me to get down i get down that's just the type of person I am. So with that, I'm like, okay, if this started in the morning time, why you didn't text me and let me know that she told you to um, sit up front, whatever the fuck, you ain't none of that. So now afternoon, she's dropping him off. He talking about she took his name and all this. Okay, well, Jalen, what you did? I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so you don't know. Well, I'm finna go find out, but I ain't tell him I'm finna find out this morning. So end up letting him go. So here come Mama Bear pop up. Oh, he looking like, damn, the whole time he ain't know I was there. Uh-huh, I blend in. <laughs> I blend in with y'all fuck ass. The whole time he ain't know I was there. So, bus came, they walking us, y'all. He the last one to get on the bus because he know he has to sit up front. So now, as they walk into the bus, now as they walk into the bus, he, um, he noticed me. He like, oh, shoot. He had no whisper to his homeboy. That's my mom behind us. I'm here. In effect. So, child, he goes to... He goes to... I, I, Hi, good morning. Was there an issue yesterday? Um, Yes, with him. Da, 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 da. She started telling me all the things, what's going on or whatever. Uh-huh, this is what I came for. You know what I'm saying? This is what I came for to find out what the fuck is what the fuck. So, pizza. it. Hold on. So, he had done. She told me all the things they was doing or whatever. So, she said she had done told the principal whatever. They just directed her to just sit him up front. So, that ended up happening. And she was like, I just told him to sit up front because they had chips. Him and some girl smashing chips, whatever. She was like, they love chips all on my bus. So, she was like, him, him, the other boy, and another girl. It's always him and his little clique, child. They all, he always got some little shit going on. So she was like, that's what they did. She was like, I told him to clean it up. They didn't want to clean it up, whatever. She was like, so yesterday I told him to sit up front. She was like, he walked straight to the back and put the hoodie on his head and was like trying to block his face or whatever like that. So I'm like, what the fuck is going on with you, boy? So now I said, okay, so she told me everything that was done or whatever, whatever. I'm like, okay, well, moving forward, what we're not going to do is that right there and whatever, you know, talk to her or whatnot. And I'm like, what is wrong with you? I mean, the simplest thing. You need a ride to freaking school because, you know, it's a long walk there. It's a long walk to the schoolhouse because, as, as you can see right now, I ain't got it. I don't have time. I got work to do. I got shit to do it, and I don't have time to be driving you up there is what I'm not going to do. This is the reason this lady get paid to drop you to school. It's always an issue at the bus stop, child. I don't know what's up with these kids. But, um... So that's what that's what ended up happening. And I just had to walk walk up there, let him know, oh yeah. And I told her, I say, you won't have no problems with him. And if you do, I'm not too far. The first house right there, I'm not too far. Let me know. Cause see, I'm that mama. I'm gonna embarrass you since you're trying to embarrass me on a low. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna embarrass you on a high. I'm gonna embarrass you on a high. I'm gonna I'm, I'm be there and, and they gonna see what the fuck is up. So that's what happened this morning pizza that i had to get up in there and let them let him know like listen you in a whole high school like why am i still walking up to this bus we gonna we gonna grow up what we gonna do is grow up we not we not we not in middle school we not in elementary school we gonna grow up is what we gonna do is what's gonna happen because you know what i'm saying you first of all i was already ticked off because he was not watching his surroundings First off, I was like, bro, he don't even see me over here. And I see him. 
he he wasn't even watching his surroundings because he was so caught up in his bullshit. Excuse me. So I, I already know him and I know that's just what he does on the daily, but whatever. But anywho, on a brighter side, it's Thursday. It's Thursday and got work to do. <laughs> hey, if we ain't had work to do, it shit wouldn't be right. Why is this giving me an error this morning? Like, why go on, man? But, um, yeah, y'all, that's where we at this morning. And, oh, guess what I wanted to talk about? I talked to my daddy last night, y'all. We was laughing on the phone. Me and my dad was talking or whatever. And he was like, um, he was like, oh, he was like, oh, she, yeah, he was talking, we was talking about, <laughs> we was talking about my mom and, and oh, Reese is right there laughing, not, not nothing bad or anything, but he was just like, you know, when people come to tell him something, he's the type of person as well, too, that he will start asking questions in between you telling him whatever you're telling him. And I was like, oh my God, daddy, I'm the same way. And I, we bust out laughing together because he was like, your mom be so mad at me when I be, um, when I be asking questions because she be missing stuff. So I need to, I need the middle. I need the details. I need to, I need that. When we rode last night and then I was like, see, babe, I'm not the only one in this way I get it from. So she came out and she was like, daddy, uh-uh. She was like, you and Fendi is too much. Y'all need to just let us get our story out before, before y'all start asking all these questions. We like, y'all too slow with it. We like, y'all too slow with it. And Bay was like, see, this is where you get it from right here. This is exactly the bus is here okay um that's isis she was like she was like see this is exactly where you get it from right here your daddy i was like yo because hunting y'all be going too slow for us we need to who what when where why what have we need all of that but see y'all start from the from the end y'all go to the front and then y'all get in the middle and then y'all back to the end and we like what the fuck we confused what Y'all do, y'all do, y'all be talking about whatever y'all talking about, but we in between, like we trying to basically analyze and envision all of this you're telling us. My dad was like, she come to me with the story and then she turned around and she get mad at me. I was like, ah, daddy, Reese does the same thing to me. I was like, she come to me with the story. She want to tell me all this and then get mad that I'm trying to understand it in my way. And <laughs> we was dying last night. We was dying last night. It was too funny. We always on the phone. What you say, babe? Oh, I think she on the phone. But, um, yes. So, we was rolling last night or whatever. That was a funny little session. I said, Daddy, I'm going to call you or whatever just so we could be on the phone talking or whatever. Me and my dad be on the phone talking and just be laughing or whatever. He was like... She, look, mommy calling me right now, y'all. I'll be back. <laughs> good morning, good morning, good morning. Y'all, this is the first time I left this house this week besides to go to the dentist. This is crazy. This is crazy, but it's a good thing. It means I've been working hard, y'all. Been working hard. So over there, y'all, let me tell you what y'all want to do this morning. Y'all want to hit that like. Y'all want to hit that comment. Y'all want to hit that subscribe. Y'all want to turn on those notifications. Y'all want to tell everybody that you know. It's your girls out here doing their thing, y'all. We want y'all to know we're ready to go, 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 y'all. We are preparing for some great things in our lives. Like, you guys just don't know the behind the scene. But I'm telling you, I'm telling you, I need you to become a super fan. I'm about to send y'all some, some information. I'm, I'm getting it prepared. I'm just giving y'all the, the, the heads up right now. Because I need you to be super fans. Because only super fans and exclusive fans get to see all the behind the scenes things that we do on a daily. Like how life starts from the beginning of the, the day to the end. You know, you'll get to see it all. Because you're going to be watching the recent Fanny Empire, y'all. There ain't nothing else for you to be out here doing. What is there for you to do? I mean, I keep telling you, if you ain't grinding, you ain't shining. So if you ain't out here grinding and shining, you, you ain't got nothing to do but to watch us. You know, 
I seen a post on Facebook and it was like saying something. It says um, people was there and laughing at you when you had your setback. Make sure and very sure that they got a front row seat when you have your major comeback. And that's some real, that's some real shit. Because, you know, you, you got people out here that be praying on your downfall. They be laughing at you. They be talking about behind your back about you. Hunty, let me tell you something. I don't care if you talk behind my back. Because they let me know I am very important to you. That I have to be the topic of your conversation. That's just what it is. But, um, y'all, it's Therapy Thursday. And, um... There's no therapy going on with us today, but, you know, just for the run up here to Starbucks, because it's double stars, double stars, Thursday at Starbucks, grab this cup of coffee, get everything going, and get my day worked up, because the kitties are in school, the kitties are in school, the kitties are in school, yeah, 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 yeah. And then um, think about what we're going to have for dinner today. I don't know yet. It's going to be something good. Because, y'all, if y'all didn't see Chef Reese's plate yesterday. Oh, y'all. Y'all. Man. That was like a five-star restaurant setup right there. Uh, don't talk about we only had four wings. Because that's all our little bellies can handle. You know, the kids had their little six wings. But that was a five-star setup right there. So, y'all, I'm about to get off of this today, and I'll be back with you later on. Be back. Let me tell y'all something. I got off the phone with Mommy, right? And we was talking or whatever. But in the midst of that, I was like, you know what? We listen to our pastor every morning, and our pastor be having a word. I promise you, it's like when I be going through stuff, and I listen to this man, it's like he hit it on the nail on how I be feeling. Listen to this. I ain't even fin. I'ma speak after I let y'all listen to what this man just said. That's why I know I don't be tripping. I know I don't be tripping. This is my pastor saying what happened to me the other day. Listen to this, y'all. To check ourselves. I don't know where I was. Oh shoot. But it was for the last two days. And man, I know where it was. I'm walking into the Apple store <laughs> and uh, I just, I'm getting my Apple computer fixed. Okay. So I'm walking in the store and a group of uh, employees were just talking. Okay. So I'm walking, I see them, they got the Apple t-shirt. I'm waiting to see if anybody says anything to me. So I'm just walking. So as I pass them, maybe three feet past them. I want to say, hey, can I help you? And my flesh, hmm. I don't know. You still have flesh? Yes. My flesh just kind of recoiled. I said, all y'all standing here talking, mm -hmm. and y'all could have spoke to me when I first came in. Mm -hmm. But after I pass you, because see, at that point, I'm just going to go to the back and talk to somebody. Then, because you know it's like a registration process and you set an appointment, all of that mess. But I was kind of perturbed. I said, why do you? But see, my problem is I kind of have a customer service mindset. Yeah. So when I don't see, when I see stuff that's not right. working right, it mm -hmm. just kind of irks me. Yes. So I wanted to do a lesson at that moment. Mm -hmm. I said, well, I needed help when I first walked in. Mm hmm and it would have been a better, but I said, Jomo, shut up. <laughs> Just shut up. Just, you know, sometimes it's not the right environment to do a teaching session on life. Because I just, I think. But respect, though. We could do better. Mm -hmm. uh, we should do better. Mm -hmm. We should speak to people when we come into a room. Mm -hmm. We should say hello. We should say goodbye. Mm -hmm. We should ask, how are you doing today? Mm -hmm. we, we Thank you very much. Thank you for your service. We should tip. Uh, we should be generous. 
uh, we should open doors. We should hold doors open. I don't know about y'all, but some stuff just bothers me when I just see just, just blatant disrespect. Come on, man. Come I think that's one of the things that really irked me. Mm hmm about some of the leaders we've had in our, our times. Just no respect, mm -mm. no honor, no decorum, just uh, so. Disrespect breeds disrespect. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because if you see it enough, before you know it, you start to do it. Mm -hmm. When have we ever rushed the Capitol building? <laughs> well, it started before disrespect. When there is no honor, well, you're going to have chaos. Yeah. When there's no respect, you're going to have chaos. So you may not see the, the overarching thing, but I told people years ago, I see, see that? That's not necessary. That's disrespect. That's going to trickle down. That's going to trickle down. And slowly but surely, our world is spiraling out of control. That's it. That's it, y'all. That is it. I don't be tripping. I don't be tripping. Let me tell you, I love myself. I love others. I definitely love my kids. My goal, I feel within life is to teach them the right way. First of all, if it's no respect, then it's nothing, nothing at all. And I do have that customer service mindset where I like to be respected because I'm already in the respect others mode. But see, when that flesh get in tune, Bitch, there is no respect because you already don't rub me the wrong way. You know what I'm saying? But I'm coming at you with all grace. Now, anything after that is because of your behavior. You know what I'm saying? That's like Jay this morning. You literally walk out here as if you don't have respect that starts from the home. That's that shit that I don't like. That's that shit that bothers me where it's like, bro, you know, I would, but your flesh tends to get you in trouble. And I don't like that. I don't like that. I don't want you to be labeled, but you, you labeled as if you can get what you want when you want it, how you want it. And in reality, you actually can, but are you doing it for yourself or is someone else doing it for you? Now, if someone else is doing it for you, in this case, someone is, it can all go to dry. It can all just come to a halt. It can all stop. Now, if you're doing it for yourself, by all means, do your thing. You know what I'm saying? Do your thing, get what you need, get what you want, how you want it, whatever. But... When you sit back and you see certain mess that be going on, it's like, what? You know what I'm saying? Like, I I put it to the, I said the other day that I'm not friendly. I'm actually not friendly. I, 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 I love people, but I love the ones that act accordingly. You get what I'm saying? Like, you, you got to just feel me on that one. You know what I'm saying? I'm cool without it. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm, I'm A1. Get it? You know what I'm saying? I'm A1 without it, but to live in this world, in this society, you need to have respect for others in order for others to look out for you, right? You need to be able to have that calm, sane mind in order for someone, for you to locate and have someone with that same type of aspect in your circle. If they not like that, they can't be in your circle. That's just what it comes with, with growing up, getting wiser, having knowledge, being acknowledged of certain things around you, your surroundings, like that shit, that shit is everything to me. You know what I'm saying? That is everything to me. This is all I'm trying to instill in my kids, yo. 
Okay. Uh, that was babe text me. Um, but that's that's it. And Pastor said that's your best. He went in an establishment. Y'all heard me the other day at the dentist's office. I was like, bro, what is this? How is y'all running y'all business like this? You know what I'm saying? Like, what? This is what y'all doing? That's why I was like, bro, when when I already know what I prayed for and I know what I asked for, so I won't be in, sitting in this position forever. This is just a momentary, you know, time right now. It's just for the moment. You know what I'm saying? But this is not my future. Is definitely not. When I hit my future, you guys will see my future because I'm, we holding on, baby. We holding on. We riding along with y'all. Y'all riding along with us, to be honest. So when I looked at it, I'm like, what? And you see what the pastor just said. He was like, I walked in, you know, the Apple store and they ain't even greet. They ain't even nothing. Like, what we doing in here? But his flesh wanted to take over and be like, yo. So my flesh wanted to take over the other day. And I was like, what is this? What is going on? Like, how you walk up on me? You ain't say nothing, but you just... Da, 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 da. I was I was over it. I was, I was over that shit because I felt like I should not have been treated like that. Because I would not, first and foremost, be treated like that. Now, if that was my business and someone complained on me about... Uh, uh, my employee about that, oh, it's a wrap. It's a wrap. Oh, you know it's going down. It's going down. You know what I'm saying? That's just how I would like my establishment to be ran. Like, don't you you greet my people when they come in. You know what I'm saying? You say hello. Hi, how you doing? All of that. Everybody have their days. It's not every day you want to speak to somebody. I get it. You know what I'm saying? Your flesh is like, I ain't for it right now. I get it. I have those days too. But I feel like when you're at work, maybe just that hello might brighten up my day. Maybe that's, you know, hi, hey, hey, hi, how you doing? Can I help you with something? Oh, well, hello, my name is such and such. I'm here to... <sighs> Just that might open up a window for me, open up a little brightness for me, let me know that shit is okay. You know what I'm saying? But you can't reach me on my level. You can't, you can't, because you're supposed to be on another level in this establishment. Wherever I just came, you, you got to be somewhere else to meet. You got to meet you. You have to meet me here. You know what I'm saying? Like if you come in that business, you have to, you have to meet your, this, this client, this member, this, you have to meet them on that level. I, I, I'm coming to your business. You have to make me feel welcomed. And it's crazy how he just said the same shit that happened to me. And that's how I felt the other day. And I was like, what? So I know for sure I wasn't tripping. It's just, it just, it goes along with respect, man. And a lot of people don't have that. That's why there's a lot of chaos in this world right now. But see, I had to go to the bus stop this morning today for my child. And it's like, bro, you know what time it is. You know what time it is, but see, when you get on the other side of this door, you act the whole fucking donkey like you ain't got that shit going on in the inside. You know what I'm saying? And you know you got that shit plus more on the inside. Like, so, so I guess when he do get outside, you know, but he's the one. Him and Dante. Jalen and Dante is the one that give me a run for my money, baby. And they know when they old girl get on that, <laughs> okay, you on that, so I'm on that too? It ain't nothing nice. It ain't nothing nice, baby. <laughs> it's not fair. It's not fair. But see, this is how these entitled kids are these days. And this is how the generation is, the, the, the new generation is being raised right now. You know what I'm saying? And the shit crazy. Shit crazy. Shit crazy, but you know what? It is what it is, man. We can only we can only do this thing day by day. Pray that we're able to have a great day. Continue going on with our life, man. And just continue to ask God for greatness. You know what I'm saying? Listen, I ask for it every day. I don't plan on giving up on myself or them. Giving up is not an option, baby. <laughs> giving up is not an option, but a real world is happening. This real life right here, it's happening. You know what I'm saying? Ain't, ain't shit to sugarcoat on it because when I have my days where I'm like, nah, I can't, I can't rock with it. You know what I'm saying? I have my sit back days. I ain't got to run my mouth every day. I ain't on that. No, 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 no. But I love you. I love you. Don't get it wrong. But I just kind of enjoy my me time. You know what I'm saying? I like, I like kind of vibing with myself. Like, 
I ain't, I ain't on it to, you know, me getting invited to places, me being, you know, approved on certain shit. It is what the fuck it is. Cause hey, the most high got me all day, baby. And I'm cool with it. I'm cool with it. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not on that. I, I just love our life. I love what we we're building. I love what we're teaching. I love the inspiration we give out. You know what I'm saying? I love the trend. I love the motivation. We give that shit all day, every day. Y'all see that. You know what I'm saying? It ain't nothing but good vibes over here. You walk in this house, it's nothing but good vibes, baby. And if it, it, it's just a bitch can't keep it down. So that's what I want to come and kind of rock with y'all today. I mean, y'all ain't fuck with your girl in a minute. Well, I ain't fuck with y'all in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> on a little sit down talk time but you know what I'm saying I was kind of feeling it this morning because I had something to really talk about so excuse me I'm gonna continue listening to my pastor because I missed him this morning like this morning I did we listened to the he has a prayer and then this is his book he be talking off of he have an ABC book like he goes through it every day when I tell y'all y'all need to look up Pastor Jomo um on Facebook YouTube all of that and he be talking man this is some real I feel like he connects so like I ain't never felt the pastor so in tune with what I like to hear you know what I'm saying? When you in tune with a pastor that that's on that level, like, bro, we can get there type shit, but he know how to snap it back. Like, okay, I'm good. But at the same time, this is, this is the world you need. Like him, that's, that's someone I love to follow. I see it in me because I, I love to follow him. I love to follow him. I love to listen to his word because his word be some real shit. You ain't got to go to the church or whatever, but hey, be in tune with it. Just listen to it. Listen to it. It will connect with your life. And when it connects with your life, bro, you be like, oh, my God, that really just happened to me. And and this is how I really took it. You know what I'm saying? Or this happened to me or may, damn, maybe I should have went this way with you. know what I'm saying? It makes you think about your life and how you really want it to be. So I felt, I felt so good just hearing that because I just felt like, bro, give me my respect. Give me my respect. I don't care about nothing else. I don't care about nothing else. Nothing, nothing. As long as I get my respect, you can keep that shit moving. Anything else you got to say uh, that it don't concern moi. It be that set. But that's something first and foremost, everyone should definitely expect you don't need to expect nothing else from nobody. But first and foremost, when you step this way, I need my respect because I'm going to give it to you. Now, if we cross that line, we cross that line and then my flesh take over and then it ain't supernatural. I'm just, I'm just going, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Like, that's just where we're going with it. But like I say, y'all go ahead. Y'all tune in, man, because he be on some real shit. I'm going to finish. I'm going to finish up over here because... A boy be talking. A boy be talking. Because this world is. Let's go, Pastor. Let's see if they'll take that shit. We're giving the rest of the clothes away, guys. We was trying to do um, one last yard sale, but we kind of see we wasn't going to have time for it. But we made a good amount from the first one. So we're just going to give the rest of it away as a donation. Yes, so the guy is about to pull around really quickly. So, give us a few. Extra stuff. Good, good. 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 Yes. Yep. So, we have that bag, yeah, and then this, we got this these box, things yeah, right there. That bag. I'm going to put this in a little box. Okay. So, that bag, this bag right here. Mm-hmm. You probably could have put all of that in one bag, or you want it separate, huh? Or, <laughs> yeah, put all in one. Yeah. Got your and bag that. receipt right there. Oh, thank you. Okay. You guys don't take furniture, huh? No, man, we do not. It would be nice. <laughs> <laughs> What's in this other box? That's glass? This glass. Okay. Stuff. I think that's it. Do y'all take um like appliances, like little small? Small appliances, we do, yeah. But yeah. Let me help you. That's <laughs> the right here. All right. Layla, we're tearing this up, baby. Make it that pink 
Um, yep, it's really do. They like y'all can take that, okay? Whatever it is, take it. Take it. We need to clear this up, baby. Yeah. New and approved coming. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to see if we got anything else. I think. Yeah. I think. What about good. these little plant things right there? No. Oh, yeah, I'm not sure. Okay. Don't worry about oh, it. So I think that's it then. I think that's it then. Yeah. Mm -hmm. He's like, you sure? Because mm -hmm. I, can, I can grab some more now. Can't grab none big shit. Fuck it. I think that's it. I think that's it. Unless he can take this um, vacuum cleaner. Vacuum cleaner? Vacuum cleaner? Yeah, as long as it's, is it empty? Yep, it's, it's empty. Okay, yep. Gotcha. Okay. I don't understand. See? We're doing good. Mm, 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 mm. And I think that's it so far. I think that's it. Yeah, you can't get any more. You just have another appointment. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. It's tax deductible, so get that coins, get that coins, get that pop, 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 pop coins. Okay, bye, y'all. We about to go to work and make our coins back. Bye. What's good? What's good? What's good, you guys? Hey, it's your girl right here coming at y'all. I'm just over here chilling and, and relaxing my my little blood pressure. Today has been such a great day. It has been a great day simply because, you know what? I'm in the land of the living and working, got the activities in my limbs, and just being able to just have a great day at work. Y'all, whoosh, I was over here messing with my camera, y'all. They bought me for for um, my, for um Christmas. Yes, that's what y'all see on the bed, my little camera bag. Just over here messing with it earlier, trying to get it together, you know, so I take some little pictures with it, do, do what I do best, become a photographer, chef, you know, all those great things. But let me take y'all in here and show y'all what I'm cooking today. Let me be right so back. Y'all, I'm making some homemade mashed potatoes right here. Got some pork chops cooking over here. Y'all know, it is what it is. We're going to have a great little meal. Bae says she can't wait. And I'm going to make some um, green beans. And y'all going to see that presentation. going to be bing. All right, be back. Right, guys, look. My baby bought me a flower today when she came home from school. I was like, oh, thank you, babe. She was, I was thinking about you, mommy, when I was walking home. Mm -hmm. I think it's so sweet. What's up, y'all? What's up? What's up? What's up? Look, y'all, guess what? Let me tell you, it is that time of the evening. And we just want to say it was a great Thursday. Everything went smoothly. Now it's time for us to just chillax it down. So, I ain't going to keep y'all on. Go ahead and hit that like, comment, subscribe. Turn on those notifications. Tell your mama, your daddy, your sisters, your brothers. Tell everybody that you know. We'll see y'all tomorrow. It's the recent Fanny Empire, baby. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Woo, woo. Bye, guys. Good night.